Welcome back. Eugene here for Gamer Parent. Thank you for tuning in and watching my first time playthrough of The Last Story. I hope you're enjoying watching so far. We are on Chapter 8. Having just finished Chapter 7, the nice little romantic scene. Here we are with Chapter 8. Before I actually trigger chapter 8, I'm going to go wander around, talk to people, see what's going on outside. Oh, I can't. Wow. Alright, Dagon wants me to get some rest. I must follow the story. He's so grouchy. Our next job should be confirmed tonight. We'll talk about it tomorrow. It's getting pretty late. You should sleep. Okay. So I'm sleeping. Time to get up, everybody. Good morning. I wish I could look out those windows. That would be cool. But all I see is light. All right, we've got our new orders. What is it this time? I'm sick of fighting those lizard things. We're doing guard duty at Lazulus Castle. A bit more appealing, eh? Not bad. The Count's throwing a ball. He's invited all the cities rich and powerful, and they don't have the manpower to cover it. <laughs> I bet there'll be some classy drinks on offer. We're heading off as soon as you're all ready. Got that? A ball? That takes me back a bit. I haven't been part of that world for years, mind. But I still remember. Ready to go? Hurry up then. We don't have all day. Alright, I just want to talk to everybody first. I wonder if the castle has a library. I do love visiting libraries. But I suspect I wouldn't be allowed. A ball, eh? Sounds fun. No one will mind if I take a few little hors d'oeuvres, right? I can't believe it, lady. Guard duty? Sounds boring. Hopefully I can just stand outside on my own. Yurik. Okay. Right, let's go. Ready to go? Then let's head to the castle. This is exciting. Guard duty. Woohoo. Lazulis Castle, Count Argonon's abode. The wedding was but one month away, and the whole castle was filled with excitement and anticipation. After all, the great houses of Argonon and Rampolt were to be joined in holy matrimony. Such a momentous occasion was the focus of the entire empire. Would you look at that? Well, I'll tell you, this Argonin chap is no slouch. Seren, stop gawping like an idiot. The ball is due to start soon. There could be feuding nobles together in the same place. 
So take care that nothing unfortunate happens. Sure thing. Seren, try not to show off your complete lack of class, eh? Shut your pie hole. You're a fine one to talk. A knight. What's up? I was just thinking. I've got a long way to go. No, oh, you mean the knights? They're in a different league to us. People may fear us mercenaries, but they look down on us too. I'll join them. Someday. <laughs> dream on, mate. It's no dream. Follow me and I swear I'll make knights out of all of you. I know you will. I need to sort out a few things here before the ball. You can go take a look around. Knowing the layout of the castle might come in handy. Oh yeah, if you want to go back, show this to the guard at the gate. Okay, let's wander around. I own a ship. Quite natural, considering my status as an import trader. Why don't you accompany me? Spending dusk on a boat is particularly enjoyable. You do talk about yourself a lot. <laughs> hmm? What did you say? <laughs> well, isn't that wonderful? Oh. Can't walk in between them, I guess. What's this? It's lovely. So let's look at the layout. Dagron, tell me to look at the layout. I see a one big room, pretty much, and stairs. One big room and stairs, and more stairs. Oh wait! It seems the Lazarus. Ah, let's talk to this person. Up there. Let's go talk to that person. Oh, and I can save here too. Let's save. So, um, you're watching the last story. This is chapter 8. We're in the palace. Doing guard duty. How did the ruler of one little island end up with a castle as grand as this? He's got to be hiding something. Oh, Yurik. Is that one of your friends bellowing in the courtyard? Can't you do something? I can't leave my post. Oh, well, maybe. I can go... Tell them to stop bellowing. If you like. Oh dear, it is. I heard the way you said mercenary just now. And? That is what you are, is it not? I'm saying I can't stand your holier than thou attitude. Your delightful manners are just what one would expect from a mercenary. Oh, you really want your ass kicked, don't you? Then bring it! Stay your blade. General Astar. You want some as well, you old git? Lady mercenary, I apologize to you for my pupil's behavior. However, this is causing quite a spectacle. So would you humor me and leave your weapon sheathed? Sure, whatever. You've killed the mood now anyway. And 
I've got better things to do. A minor crisis averted. This day is a joyous one. We ought to enjoy it. Zotherius, what were you thinking? No one would believe you were a knight if they saw you behave in such a manner. General. The public expects us to act with decorum at all times. To betray that trust is a great dishonor. My sincere apologies. Raise your head, Therius. No need to look so depressed. My apologies, General. <laughs> you know, I just paid a visit to the castle barracks. I see. Your thoughts, General. Lazarus Island is too peaceful. The result? Knights who forget their swords. They think not of their duty, but only of themselves. I agree, General. The knights I see here are totally devoid of aspirations. Indeed, the mercenary we just met seemed much more adept as a swordsman. Quite. Therius. I am thinking of training another knight here. You wish to take on a new pupil? <laughs> Is that worry I hear? Fear not. I doubt anyone could surpass you. Therius, I feel that the cloying peace of this island hides something darker. If there is anywhere that requires honorable knights, is it not this island? Agreed. With each day that goes by, more pain is caused throughout the Empire by the land's decay. And this island is a key location. So having a knight here who the people can trust could ensure peace throughout the entire Empire. Indeed. So Therius, when that time comes, you must work together with that person. Yes, General. It will be as you wish. Therius, it's just you and me. No need to be so formal. As you command. Therius, I just said not to... No. No wonder you're not a hip with the ladies. The city's nice enough, but the castle's filled with some right creeps. Barbaric woman, raising her voice in the castle like that. Yes, isn't she? I think I want to be that knight. Will you train me? What's the matter? Are you lost? This is my first time here as well. Sometimes I get lost. Hey, Therius. General, I'm sure one of the servants would guide you if you asked. And make me look like a fool? Certainly not. So you see, if you're seeking a guide, you might wish to look elsewhere. I'm not seeking a guide. But I guess that's all you got for me. Alright. I want to be a knight too. Alright, I'm going back in. I heard General Astar is searching the castle for something. I heard it's something to do with the decaying of the lands within the Empire. Curious. Alright, back to the Great Hall. I wonder if I talk to that guard, whether I'll get some reward for taking care of his problem for him. Probably not. Map travel, okay. Let's try that out. Map travel. 
Oh ho. So I just need to go to that icon. I can go to the library or the courtyard. Great. And I can zoom out. I can zoom in. Oh, in and out. Awesome. Yes, I'm going here. That's kind of where I am already, but that's fine. Oh, nice. Let's see what these people the are. Lady Callista is Lord Gerald's betrothed. <laughs> Today will mark Lady Callista's debut in high society. The Rambolt family's position, combined with the Argonan family's assets, will surely change the balance of power within the Empire. Can you tell me what colour dress Lady Callista will be wearing? I'm sorry, my lady. I do not know. You don't? Oh. Well, these nobles are really snobby. Alright, so exploring the castle. I'm going upstairs. We finished sorting out the details. Are you ready, Zale? No, I want to go to the library. I'll be waiting here. Finish your business first. Okay. Sorceress. It was here on the island that I first met that beautiful sorceress. Okay, and History of the Empire. In three pages. Long ago, before the Empire was founded, this continent was torn by centuries-long war. Many kingdoms rose, only to fall in the constant struggle for dominion. It is told that from amidst this relentless warfare emerged one benevolent king, who established the kingdom that was to become the foundation of our Empire. Humans in Gurak who are Gurak? Okay. Ah. Oh. Humans are always doing bad stuff. Banish the Gurak to the land in the far south. Great. Wonderful. Right, there's a powerful weapon on Lazulus Island. Just for peace, okay. Wow, that was cool. Mm, what now? The book's still out on loan, and I can't find a copy for sale anywhere. Doesn't anybody have a copy of the Art of Magic? Oh, little kid. You know what? I'll make you a deal. If I find one, I'll sell it to you. Right. I got that. Okay, can I climb up this ladder? Oh, I can. Ha ha ha, awesome. Okay. Huh. 
twins. Kids, 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 you're in my way. Okay, I am guess I can't go there. Freaky kids. Are there kids here too? Boy. Oh yes! I got past her. Awesome! There must be something good here, right? Because they blocked it off with those kids. Oh. Guess not. say I'm somewhat disappointed. <laughs> Sorry, girls. Okay, so, um, let's get out of here. This library's boring. Oh, there's another kid. So there's all the kids in the library. Don't they know they should be outside playing, or... Video games or something? Okay. Um, what's down this way? Nothing. Just the hall. The hall down there. This would be a great place to shoot things from. Maybe I should shoot bananas from here. No. I'm not allowed to shoot bananas. Too bad. Okay, is there anything on this side? People. Please refrain from entering this room. Okay. Just passing by. I'm sorry, but this area is not ready yet. Oh. Okay. Is there any jewel in the world that is beautiful enough to suit me? Probably not. Hey lady, what are you looking at? Oops, sorry. We finished sorting out the details. Are you ready, Zale? Oh, stained glass. Right. Time for work. Don't let me down. I won't, Dagrin. I promise. I won't let you down.